Hi! In this video, I will be showing how to create budgets using our Cloud Extend Excel data management for NetSuite. Here is the budget form. Each budget in NetSuite covers the year for which you can enter an amount per account for each period. You can create specific budgets for customers or projects, items, classes, departments, or location. Let us determine the header and line level fields that we will be using and make sure to include all mandatory fields. Use the field ID name in template creation. Click the name above the field and check the field ID. Since I will use budget category, I will look for category in our template builder. I already prepared a template and added year, budget type, category, and customer. Just a tip, if you want to assign budgets to different categories, this will enable you to create different budgets for the same set of class, department, or location criteria. Now I'm ready to add the line level fields. That will be the account and period amount. You can add period or months you want to allocate budget until period amount 12. So let's load a template and fill up the fields. This budget is for year 2022 with budget type global, category legacy, and customer, which will be for Saligo. I want to create budgets for accounts, automobile expense, sales merchandise, purchases service, and my budgets are set from period 1 to 12. Now I can click update, upsert all records, notice that each lines have their own internal ID. Let's download existing budget records into the template. Now let's create a simple filter to pull data from NetSuite, click download, Set criteria for the year. I will choose FY 2022, add a new rule, and set category legacy. Add another rule. Um, let's choose customer, and I'll add Saligo Inc. And then click download. This will pull records with the same criteria. Now, what I want to do is to add an account to an existing budget record. And since I pulled the budget record, I need to have the same header field values to where I want the new lines to be appended. I will add two new accounts for this budget. This will be for furniture and fixtures and meetings and social media events. Let's copy paste the values to the account and then the period values. I'll click Absurd. And if I go back to NetSuite and check the budget record, two new lines has been added. You can create multiple budget records with the same year. Let me show you how. Here's the existing budget record that I want to recreate. Take note of the header values in NetSuite. You can create budget under the same year, but on a different budget category. So here we have year 2022, budget category legacy. So on our download feature in Cloud Extend, let's get these records. So let's set the filter criteria to have year 2022, Budget Category Legacy. Now, once save, click Download, and it will stream down the budget records to your Excel. Since I want the same details, I will change the category from Legacy to Scenario 1. Then, I will clear out the internal ID. I'll go to Update, and then click Absert All Records. And in NetSuite, this is the new budget under a different budget category. So as you can see here, this is the old one with the budget category legacy, and this is the new one under FY 2022, but this is under the budget category scenario one. If you want to make changes to an account in the budget record, you need to get the internal ID of the record matching the headers and account. Here is the budget record in that suite and I want to update the automobile expense amount. I will look for the matching internal ID, paste it on the internal ID field, and click Refresh. This will retrieve the data from NetSuite, and let's update the amount, click Absurd, and in NetSuite, that change will reflect as you can see here. 
So this is the same if you want to delete a line inside the budget. Say, on this budget, I want to remove 6085 furniture and fixture expense. Get the matching internal ID. And then, in the Cloud Extend app, click Delete after refreshing. And then when you go back to NetSuite, that account will no longer be there. Hope you find this worthwhile. Thanks for watching.